everyone welcome to my channel Tuesdays with Tish thanks for tuning in this Tuesday um, sorry I missed a couple of weeks it's been kind of crazy so uh, I do apologize for that um, I did want to share with you some of my Christmas haul um, coach haul that I got um, probably will be in two parts um, I haven't received some of my items from other purchases. So um, I'll kind of try to make this as quick as possible. I won't really be doing a review, just kind of revealing um, some of what I was able to purchase. I would probably do um, some videos on pieces separately, kind of reviewing them. This is just kind of giving you a first look of what I got. So let's get started. Um, well, the first two bags I wanted to show you are a couple of black bags. I don't know if you had a chance to view a couple of my videos back that I mentioned that I do not own all black bag. So finally, I have all black bag. Still probably searching for maybe a larger size one, but these two will work for now. So let's get started the first one is the good old coach cassie so i know that many of you have this bag have purchased have seen several reviews on i do have several other colors in this bag but i never actually had a black one and actually the black color is probably one of my favorites in this silhouette so here's my black cassie um i probably do a quick little review how i will dress it up um so i do have some ideas to not make it so plain but i do enjoy it plain as well it looks pretty cute uh the other black bag that i got is the um coach dinky in uh, um, signature embossed leather and sorry i thought i saw something on there this is actually the smallest bag i've ever owned um it's really cute really small um i probably only will wear this going out probably wear it as a clutch style it does come with a crossbody long strap which i think kind of sucks um it's just a skinny little leather strap. Don't really care for it too much. I know when the Dinkies first came out, they were making them with a chain strap with interwoven like leather. And I thought this would be so cute on the signature embossed leather, but unfortunately, um, they don't make them like that anymore. But it is all leather interior. It's an all leather bag. Has cute um i would say a wine colored i wouldn't really say this was like the ox blood it might it may be ox blood i do have an ox blood cassie i could compare it to to see if it's the same color but yeah these are my two two black bags um the next purchase was actually from the outlet I did do an actual review on this particular style bag it was one of my first videos um, but they did come out with another color um, I do love pink love to wear pink and I actually do have one other pink bag but it's more dressier and it's like of a hot pink bag I'll probably share it a later video but um, because I liked the other one so much I, I I just really had to have it in that color. So let me show you. It is another city tote. So if you guys recall, my other video was on a city tote, but it was in the rainbow signature canvas. Um, this one is called the um, signature city tote in candy pink. So I really love this pink color. Um, it's super cute. It has the same kind of dark red interior as the rainbow one. If you recall, I still have it over here. So 
here's the rainbow one. Um, I just got this one yesterday, so it's still stuck. But here's the rainbow one if you guys didn't get a good look before. Um, hopefully, maybe you can get a better look now. But that wasn't part of this haul. But what to match with it, I thought was super duper cute. I've always wanted a coin purse. And um, for us, how small they are, they're rather expensive. So when this came out, I thought it was super cute. It's also in the um, Candy Pink Signature Canvas. Um, and the little Kiss Lock has two different pink balls on it. And it's a really cute little bag. So that was my little accessory to go with it. Um, thought it was really cute. If you want the, um, the rainbow bag, it did come back in stock. I know when, when I filmed the video, it was out of stock. But it is back in stock. It is priced a little bit higher than what I paid for it when it first came out. Along with this one is a little bit higher than the rainbow tote. I believe this one's $129. Now, I didn't pay $129, but I think that's what it's priced at. The rainbow also may be $129 now. Um, but if you guys were looking for it, it's back in stock now. Go check it out. Um, my last two pieces were things I really had a hunt for. And I'm really excited that I am able was able to buy. Um, they are retail bags, but these bags are no longer in production. If it's something that you probably want, um, you may want to try the... Try the um, after sale market like Macari or eBay or Poshmark or something like that um, so let me get to those they're really cute retail bags I I just actually didn't even know about these styles until recently so when I when I was able to see them I became obsessed so um, I will show you the first one, which is, ta-da, this is the Coat Troop Carry-All 35 in Army Green. Um, as you can see, I'm pretty obsessed with like the signature canvas from my other go-to lately has been snakeskin. So this bad boy is trimmed in late, or snakeskin um, on the top and these little two pull tabs to pull it open. So this it has a really strong magnetic um, closure to it. I really like it. It's a nice large size bag. Uh, I love the hang tag. It's, it's uh, printed with this uh, snakeskin as well. So I thought that's super cool and unique. Um, I actually, was looking for a green bag. I'm like, man, I've been really into like red and green and blue lately. And I was thinking, man, I really wanted a green bag. And somehow I came across this. Um, I was able to have it shipped from another store, another coach store directly to me. Had to call around to find it. I was told that this was the last one in, in the United States. So I'm very happy to have her here with me. She's super cute. Um, the side panels are actually black suede. And I thought that was a really great detail. I do really uh, like bags with the mixed leathers. Um, I'm just really attracted to them. And what's also cool is that it has the four feet. So that was one of the highlights of my haul. And the last one, was actually something I, this is really a kind of a long sorted story about, but once I uh, caught wind of this bag, I just fell in love instantly. Can't find it anywhere. I was um, ready to buy it in the resale market and um, had a little tiff, I guess you should say, with the seller it was very, I don't know, I, I've, I've sold a lot of things in Mercari. I've bought things in Mercari. I've never had an issue. This person seems a little sketchy, um, seemed a little bit, I don't know. Like, I feel like when you're buying stuff like that, you ask a lot of questions because it's not like you can just return it 
to the store, you're buying it from a person and whatever, that didn't work out. Um, so, um, I was able to, um, share my story with a, a Facebook group that I'm a part of that, um, once I, you know, put it out there what I was looking for and what kind of what happened, uh, one of the lovely ladies in the group had one brand new with tags willing to sell it to me. So that's how I was able to snag it. So this last bag is to die, okay? So here she is. Isn't she gorgeous? Oh, I'm so in love with this bag. So out of all these bags, I will definitely be doing a review on this one and this troop, possibly the dinky and probably the others that I have coming in. So anyways, this one is gorgeous. It has a smooth glove band leather. This is called um, the Coach Dreamer shoulder bag. I am in search of some other colors because once I actually was able to get this one in my hands, I did fall in love with the silhouette. I love the straps that it comes with, um, it comes with two straps. Um, and I love that it has the saddle leather, the black leather, the rivets. I mean, it just has so much going on. It's so cool. Um, the snake skin, the black and white snake skin on the sides and on the panels here. It is just so gorgeous. I love this bag. Um, so yeah, I won't get too much into it because I, I do think it deserves its own video. <laughs> but I will quickly show you its, uh, its chain strap. It's really long and I really like that it's longer um, for me because as I mentioned, I am a tall girl and I like that it's longer, that it looks decent on me as a crossbred body bag. So here is the strap, the chain strap. The other one's a thick infinity strap. I don't think I have it in the bag right now. Excuse me. But I don't think that I will use it for this bag. I just think it's so kind of upscale feeling that I don't want it to look casual. And I feel like the leather strap will make it look a little casual. But it is a really good strap. It's a really nice thick strap which is surprising because I do not like the straps that come with this troop. So I, I probably won't wear that strap. Um, do not like the straps that come with this dinky. The Cassie's pretty cool, but those, and I think that I will actually use this strap with the dinky too. So tell me what you think. I think it might look cute, let's see. Yeah, I think that will work. That's cute. Okay. I like that. So, anywho, that's my part one of my Christmas coach haul. Um, I don't know if I'll be keeping everything. Definitely this one. Um, and definitely Cassie. Uh, the others, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to wait to see um, the other items that I get in. Um, and you can also tell me what you think of these bags and what you may be digging on or what you have here that you and what your experience are is with these bags and how what you like and maybe dislike about them to help me make my final decision. Um, that's all I have for you today. I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas and I really thank you and appreciate you for tuning in. As always, please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you so much and have a great evening. Bye.